I still win a lot. I've played only a little bit though, but yet I can win a lot. And so these level ones, I have played the level one through like level five, and they they are not that hard, even though they do hit you like every time. Like no joke, it's like the freaking bots from Call of Duty Ghosts, they can just find you wherever you are. I mean, it's insane. Yeah, but my I have a new video going up around when this one should be going up, probably a little sooner. But and but sorry for not uploading a Minecraft Let's Play because my friend was not here, and so that couldn't happen because it's like a two people thing. And also, my mic wasn't working. But as you can see, I got a a really good app for here, and so that should be good. That's a hit. And so, I'm probably going to do about two, maybe one level a game. Yeah, these nice level one bodies are too good. Now, I don't know about you guys, but if you guys want me to, leave in the comments and I might buy a DLC. And But after I beat every single one of these, I'll probably do online play, and so that'll be fun. Maybe even do a 1v1 against against Blake the Doc, as he calls himself. Oh wow. Yeah, some of these bots just get annoying sometimes. I don't know if it's really necessary to put your power all the way up with the gamma gun, but I do. This isn't Fallout 4, it's a gamma gun. Yeah, but I, I was, I'm starting a let's, like, um, my mini battles on my channel, and so that should be good. Oh, wow. See, I, I'm pretty bad at this game. But over the next few games, I hope I can get better. Probably won't, but oh my god. Freaking forget to change the angle every time. And now he direct hit. Oh. Yeah. So this level 1 bot is pretty easy. So I might do level 1, 2, and maybe 3. If you guys. But every time I should at least get 1 done. And when I get up to like 8, 9, and 10. Um, yeah, it's gonna be only one, because those battles either take really long, or really short. And, of course. Yeah, that's what I don't get about this, that one. It always shoots you back, like, when you're in the back of the map. But then you just, like, land right where you were. Yeah. That's, I like doing those dirt balls, because then usually the bots usually launch their normal attack, and it'll kill, they kill themselves. And so there's a tip. And also, when they use use like um those digger ones, like, and when they go in, like one of those, and so when they're trapped in the hole, you launch one of your you launch a napalm or a hailstorm, they usually die, or you get a lot of hits hit points. But as you can see, I haven't even taken one damage yet. So this was a pretty easy game, and, and we're probably going to move on to the next round after this. As soon as this guy launches his last attack, which, oh wow, nope, way over. There we go, there's level one down, now let's move on to the next one. Level two. Ooh, lots of Gamma Blasters. Yeah, these Gamma Blasters are really good. They take a lot of the their points down really fast. And also the bots, they, they like to choose like the heavy hitters, and then they leave the normals for last. But I guess that's what everyone does, so... Probably not a tip there. But these videos each are gonna be about... Mm, 
10 minutes, 15 minutes, because once after that everyone gets bored, even though they probably already are bored. <laughs> yeah, these fireballs? Fireballs are really good, I don't know why I haven't been picking them. And like, what's the deal with like, the worms and stuff? They aren't really good. They Like, unless you get a direct hit, they aren't good, unless you want to just sink your enemy in a hole. But then again, like I said earlier, that's why you have the, like, digger ones. And how'd I lose two there? Oh, see, this is what I mean. You get to these later levels, and like I said, they you, they get a direct hit, like, every time. But once they're in, like, a tricky spot, they're pretty easy to take down. Oh my gosh. Forgot he had a gamma gun. Oh yeah. These spiders, you want to launch like them up like an aerial attack because once they come down, they launch like fire attack. That I realized my accuracy on this game has been really on lately. Yeah, but once you get to level like two or three, they start hitting you almost every time. It, it's insane. But once I finish all these, we're gonna do. Wi-Fi play, online play, and I might buy some of the DLCs. So that would be good. Yeah, I got a little focus there. <laughs> yeah, but if you guys could leave a like on the video, if I win this match, if I don't, I would like you to have a dislike, but I'll probably win. Because I should win against a level 2. If I don't, I should get streamed. Oh, oh wow, watching him himself. Yeah, but as you can see, those fireballs are like the skippers. But they do a lot more damage. And once you find your enemy, one, once you have their location and they're like trapped somewhere and they can't move, um, you basically got them killed. It's because you, if they can't find you, you're like a guaranteed win. Ooh, that was close, though. But, usually, once you get to, like, level 5 and stuff, that's when it gets pretty hard. Kinda hard. You know, that's about where I stopped. But, yeah, this match is almost over, and once, once I win this game, I will end the video. And thank you guys for watching. If you wouldn't mind, leave a like and subscribe. Yeah. Well, it might not be over yet, actually. So don't leave a like just yet. See, and they, the fireballs have a good range on the down, so I have direct hit. They do 50 damage. So I think I got this one in the bag. Oh, no, not... These ones are, that's a pretty good one, the Crazy Ivans, they, they do a lot. And also, there's these missile tur turrets that just got added. Those are good, they can like take down mountains and they can take a lot of damage away from the enemy. But thank you guys for watching the video. Leave a like and subscribe if you would like to. And yeah, this is Deadly Dash, signing off.